Looking for ways to boost your mental health this summer? Let's dive into six daily habits that can make a huge difference. Have you ever wondered how summer can affect your mental well-being? Stay with us to find out. The heat, extended daylight, and changes in routine during summer can significantly impact our mental health. Higher temperatures can lead to irritability, extended daylight can mess with our sleep schedules, and the overall change in pace can sometimes increase stress. Maintaining mental well-being is crucial for a more enjoyable and productive summer. By adopting some healthy habits, you can enhance relaxation, boost your energy levels, and improve overall life satisfaction. In this video, we'll share six daily habits that can help keep your mind healthy and sharp during the summer months. And make sure to watch until the end for a special bonus tip on maintaining these habits year-round. Habit number one, engage in creative activities. Engaging in creative activities can significantly boost mental health by reducing stress and promoting a sense of accomplishment. Creative activities serve as an outlet for expressing emotions, which can improve your mood and provide a great sense of fulfillment. Here are some ways to get those creative juices flowing. One, painting. Grab some paint and a canvas and let your imagination run wild. Don't worry about the outcome, just enjoy the process. Two, writing. Jot down your thoughts, start a journal, or even write a short story. Writing can be very therapeutic. Three, crafting. Try your hand at DIY projects or crafts. It's a great way to focus your mind and create something beautiful. When should you do these activities? I suggest setting aside a specific time each day for your creative pursuits, even if it's just 10 to 15 minutes. The key is consistency. And don't be afraid to try new creative hobbies you've always been curious about. Habit number two, outdoor reading sessions. Benefits of outdoor reading. Reading is a fantastic way to escape reality, reduce stress, and stimulate your mind. But did you know that reading outdoors can enhance these benefits even further? When you read outside, you combine the mental benefits of reading with the physical and psychological benefits of being in nature. The fresh air, natural light, and serene environment can boost your mood, improve focus, and provide a relaxing backdrop for your reading sessions. To make the most of your outdoor reading sessions, here are some tips. Look for a quiet spot in a park, garden, or even your backyard where you can relax without distractions. The more tranquil the environment, the better. Bring a comfortable chair, blanket, or even a hammock to sit or lie on. Comfort is key to enjoying your reading time. Choose light, enjoyable books or magazines that you can easily dive into. Summer is the perfect time for fun and engaging reads. Don't forget to bring a bottle of water or a refreshing drink to keep yourself hydrated while you read. Remember, the goal is to create a relaxing and enjoyable experience that you look forward to. So, pick your favorite book and head outside for a refreshing reading session. Habit number three, gardening. Therapeutic effects of gardening. Gardening is more than just a hobby. It's a powerful therapeutic activity that can have profound effects on your mental health. Engaging in gardening can reduce stress, improve your mood, and provide a sense of purpose and accomplishment. The act of nurturing plants and watching them grow can be incredibly satisfying and grounding. Plus, spending time in nature and working with your hands can help you disconnect from daily stresses and connect with the natural world. Starting small, if you're new to gardening, here are some tips to get you started. Begin with plants that are easy to grow and maintain, such as herbs, succulents, or flowering plants. These plants typically require less attention and can give you a sense of success early on. Dedicate a few minutes each day to tend to your garden. Water your plants, check for any pests, and enjoy the process of caring for them. Gardening is a learning experience. Don't be afraid to make mistakes and learn from them. There are plenty of resources available, such as gardening books, online forums, and local gardening clubs. Focus on the enjoyment and relaxation that gardening brings. 
It's not just about the end result, but also about the journey and the calming effects it has on your mind. Whether you have a large backyard or just a small balcony, gardening can be a wonderful way to improve your mental health this summer. So, grab some soil, pick out a few plants, and start your gardening journey today. Habit number four, digital detox days. We live in a digital age where screens are an integral part of our daily lives. From smartphones and computers to tablets and televisions, we are constantly surrounded by digital devices. While these devices offer convenience and entertainment, excessive screen time can lead to mental fatigue, stress, and even anxiety. Taking regular breaks from screens is essential for maintaining mental clarity and reducing the strain on our minds. One effective way to combat the negative effects of excessive screen time is by designating one day a week as a digital detox day. Here's how you can implement it. Pick a day of the week that works best for you. It could be a weekend day when you have fewer work obligations and can focus on offline activities. Fill your detox day with activities that don't involve screens. This could include reading a physical book, going for a walk, cooking, exercising, or spending quality time with family and friends. Inform your close contacts about your digital detox day so they know you'll be offline. This helps manage expectations and reduces the temptation to check your devices. If a full day seems too daunting, start with a few hours and gradually increase the duration as you get comfortable with the concept. By incorporating regular digital detox days into your routine, you can reduce mental fatigue, improve focus, and enhance your overall well-being. Habit number five, practicing gratitude. Practicing gratitude is a simple yet powerful habit that can significantly improve your mental health. Gratitude shifts your focus from what you lack to what you have, fostering a positive mindset and enhancing overall well-being. Studies have shown that regularly practicing gratitude can reduce stress, increase happiness, and even improve physical health. One of the most effective ways to cultivate gratitude is through daily journaling. Here's how you can start. Choose a specific time each day to write in your gratitude journal, Many people find it beneficial to do this in the morning to start their day on a positive note or at night to reflect on the day's events. Each day, write down three things you are grateful for. They can be big or small, such as a kind gesture from a friend, a beautiful sunset, or simply having a delicious meal. The more specific you are, the more impactful your gratitude practice will be. Instead of writing, I'm grateful for my family, you could write, I'm grateful for the way my family supports and encourages me. Take a moment to reflect on each entry and savor the positive feelings associated with them. This helps reinforce the habit and magnifies its benefits. By making gratitude journaling a daily habit, you can shift your focus to the positive aspects of your life, improve your mental health, and cultivate a lasting sense of contentment. Habit number six, volunteer work. Volunteering is more than just a way to give back. It's a powerful tool for boosting mental health. Engaging in volunteer work can provide a profound sense of purpose, reduce stress, and increase overall happiness. Helping others often leads to a sense of accomplishment and can strengthen your social connections, which are essential for mental well-being. Here's how you can get started with volunteering. Look for volunteer opportunities in your community that match your interests. This could be anything from helping out at a local food bank to participating in environmental cleanup projects. Choose activities that you're passionate about or that resonate with your values. This will make the experience more fulfilling and enjoyable. If you're new to volunteering, start with a manageable commitment like a few hours a week and gradually increase as you become more comfortable. Reach out to local nonprofits or community centers to learn about current opportunities and how you can get involved. Volunteering not only benefits those you help but also offers significant mental health benefits for yourself. Bonus tip. Summer brings longer days and warmer weather, which can impact your daily routine. Adjusting your schedule to fit the season can help maintain balance and well-being. This might involve shifting your workout times, incorporating more outdoor activities, 
or even adjusting your sleep schedule to align with the longer daylight hours. Be flexible with your routine and embrace the seasonal changes. Making small adjustments, like moving your exercise outdoors or finding new ways to stay cool, can make a big difference in maintaining your mental and physical health. Remember, consistency is key. By integrating these summer habits into your daily routine, you can enhance your mental well-being and make the most of the season.